Hey curl friends. So today I'm actually going to be doing an in-depth video on how I use Up North Naturals hair products. Um, the last video that I did with them, I didn't go into depth. I actually just said, hey, this is what I use and here's my hair and it's great. Um, and then I had somebody comment saying, hey, can you please show a video step by step how you use their products? And I'm like, <laughs> duh. <laughs> so that's what I'm going to do now. So, I wash my hair by using their Clean Curls Cleanser. Still try to say that fast. Okay. And then, I um, wash that out and then I put in the TLC Replenishing Conditioner as a leave-in. Now, I like to leave my leave-ins for about an hour to two hours. I'm going to show you guys exactly how I use their products and how amazing my hair is going to look. Okay, so I start off with sectioning my hair. So let's section. So I don't do big sections. Um, just cause I really want my hair to soak in all of the product that it possibly can. So I'm going to start off by wetting my hair. Okay, now my hair is completely wet. Obviously only on this side, because, uh, whoa. And now, I'm going to go ahead and put in my go-to hydrating hair milk. <laughs> okay, boom. I don't want it to fall again. You want to get every single strand of hair. It smells so good. I just, I love their products. I don't understand. Look, the slip is amazing. I know you guys want, I'm trying to be as detailed as possible. So I'm going to show you guys exactly how much I'm using and then describe the product. So the slip is amazing. It feels really good. Um, my hair is already detangled, so I like to detangle before I start putting in my product. So I'm going to put a little bit more. Like I said, my hair requires a lot of moisture. Normally, I try not to talk a lot during my videos, but since somebody had asked me to like be more detailed, then that's what I want to do for you guys. So more hair milk. Boop. Don't worry, I have my second bottle sitting right there. I didn't put a lot this time. Like, whoa, just look at that really quick. Ew. Okay, you see? And then, I'm gonna do, you know what? I was gonna do the other side and then do it like that, but I'm not, right? Because I wanna be real detailed. So what I'm going to do is <laughs> continue with this side. So now that I put in the go-to hydrating hair milk, I'm actually going to go ahead and put in their eight oil defining jelly. Mm, it's literally like a jelly, like. I do not use a lot of this stuff, which is why I still have this jar that has hair on it. Um, <laughs> literally, like, you do not need a lot, okay? This, honestly, I've noticed helps with making my hair look moisturized while it's dry. Like, it's insane what this stuff does to your hair. So your hair, it also helps your, your curls form together. Um, as you can see, that is what it is doing. And then when you tap it off with the curlies, it helps it form even more. Now, I am going to go in with the Curl Ease Styling Lotion. One of my favorites. Wow. 
and it literally just formed your curls together all the way down to the bottom and your hair is going to look so moisturized so defined I like to get it from the root all the way down to the ends I'm going to put a little bit more Now let's talk consistency. That's not too thick. Um, the Curly Styling Lotion is not thick, actually. If we are going to compare consistency, the Jelly obviously has more of a thicker consistency than the Curly Styling Lotion. They work well together. That's one thing that I love about these products is that they all work so well together. Um, I've used some products where it's the same line, and it does not work well together it'll leave a whole bunch of like white pieces in my hair this does not do that so you are able to use multiple products from the same line in your hair and it doesn't leave all that white sticky stuff in your hair that some products do so i am going to go ahead and do this side now so i also wanted to show you guys how i section my hair i don't like to do really big pieces because then I realized later on when I'm drying, some of my hair is, is poofy, it's frizzy, um, it didn't get the moisture that it needed. So yeah, I started sectioning in smaller pieces. So the same way that I do it in the beginning, how I'll section it in like a half, and then I'll um, section that into two, <laughs> excuse me, is the same exact way that I do my entire head. So then I, as you saw, I went straight across, and then cut down the middle. Now, for the bigger pieces like this, I honestly do love to go in and use my Denman brush. When I'm doing the real small pieces in the back, it's easier to just um, finger my hair out, but bigger pieces, I definitely like to use my Denman brush. It makes my curls more defined. Um, right now there's only water in my hair, but I'm making sure that when I apply my product, um, it goes into every strand of my curls and I don't have to worry about using product to detangle my hair. So. That was only using the go-to hydrating. This is a bigger piece, so I'm going to be using a little bit more than I would with the smaller pieces. If I had to pick two favorite products from this line, which I love the entire line, which is why I keep buying it. <laughs> but if I had to pick, it would definitely be this jelly. Cause you guys don't understand how moisturized this jelly makes my hair look after it's dry um and it would be the curly styling lotion which is what i'm applying next and then back to the curlies let's see look at that wow Voila. Ah. So it's already super defined. Like I told you guys, um, I love their products. I can't talk about them enough. But like I said, I'm going to show you guys how I section my hair even further. Oh, boom. You saw that double chin? That was crazy. Really. Now, even this takes time. Like, if you're not used to this, please don't get frustrated. Yes, it can be very frustrating. Trust me. But um, you'll get it. Don't worry. Just keep trying. All right. So, yes. Like I said, I like the back of my hair to be full. So, I make sure there's a good amount back here so that it's, like, big once it dries. So, I actually um, wanted to show you guys, after I wet it or whatever, 
I make sure that when I'm putting the product in, I put it in the way that you want your hair to dry, the way you want to style your hair. So you don't just want to throw product in your hair like whatever kind of way and then think that when you dry it, it's going to turn out how you want. No. So what I do is, as you can see, I already wet this side. So then when I'm applying product, which I'll show you really quickly. This is the go-to. I'll apply it the way that I want my hair to dry. So I'm going to, literally, this is how I'm going to apply the whole line of products that I'm using today. I apply it this way, just like this, because that's how I want my hair to dry. I wanted to show you guys the definition of my hair. And now I'm going to go dry. And we're back. So this is the final product. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> Yay. Um, like I said, I love their products. I have nothing bad to say about their products at all. Like it just does miracles to my hair. I'm so in love. So um subscribe, like, comment. Obviously, I look at you guys' comments and, you know, how I can better myself and how I can help you more. Um, I did this video because somebody had asked me to. So, I hope this was much better. Um, and thank you guys for watching. <laughs>